Brad, I just really forgot toilet paper. I got paper. Definitely gonna need that. I got plenty of paper. Oh my! It's huge! You don't want to take an AC unit? Huh? We don't need AC? No, thank you. <laughs> we need a heater. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Here we are, almost to the piece of public we're going to hunt. You guys pumped? It's like the, the first major cold front of the year. Uh, what was it, this morning, 70 degrees? When I got up it was like 70. When we left my house it was 62, so it was already cooling off. Yeah, and it's 48 now. And it's supposed to just keep, keep dropping, it's supposed to get I've been here 10 minutes. Well, here's home for the next few days. Three dudes in a 12 foot trailer. <laughs> nice and cozy. Good luck. Good luck. Don't miss. set up a few minutes ago big cold front coming in so be dropping the whole time we're here i've hunted this area uh, a couple weeks ago seen a pretty nice eight point across this top of this little hill right here i was down lower hoping they may do the same thing today being the time of year and this cold front coming in we might get some cruising bucks too we'll see what happens i got the wind right I'm not in the most comfortable tree, but I think we can make it work. There's a lot of crooked trees out here. What do you got there, Brad? Deer steak, mashed potatoes, and corn. Mm. Yes, Tastes so much better in camp, too. Oh, yeah. Got the Thunder game going. Getting some old mashed potatoes. Yeah. Our uh, cooktop kind of malfunctioned. So we didn't get to cook all the steaks that we had. How are y'all feeling about it? I don't know. 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 I don't know
Oh, yeah. What was that, Spanky? The moon. They screwed us. It's all full moon. Yeah, yeah but it's cloudy. Yeah, That's I think we'll be alright with the moon. And rainy. I'm feeling really good about it. Fixing to go climb a tree. About to eat my nutty butters. Sit in the same spot I sat last night. Just got daylight a few minutes ago. Haven't seen nothing. But there was a few deer blowing when I was coming in. So I hope that didn't screw it up too bad. I got my blaze orange on because today is opening day of black powder. I'm tucked back in the pretty thick stuff here. So I'm hoping I won't have nobody walking around out here. We'll see what happens. lunch time we we're going to go grab a bite to eat and come back out well i got some hair what happened i spooked it spooked what a coyote uh. a coyote uh -huh. i walked by a stop because a truck drove past me and i turned around and looked to see where the truck was going and i looked to my right and this coyote just sitting there 30 yards off the road i was like okay stayed sitting there so finally i took my backpack off i got my release out i put it on i got my range rider out thing's still sitting there i called it looking at you? So yeah just well looking at me looking away as calm as can be about 30 yards what in the world but it was through some tree limbs and uh i called trenton again to make sure we we're okay to shoot them i thought we was but i wasn't sure and about that time he started talking to me she got up and turned sideways so i just literally dropped my phone <laughs> pulled back the shot but i broke my knock i don't know how i done it. i think i hit a tree limb because i put it on her and it it looked like it dropped hmm. just under I, it got i got hair down one of the blades on the side i i used one of my good broadheads and we told you not to miss let's go to pizza hut let's go to pizza hut so i've had a major change up in the game plan i have moved spots came over to a spot I hunted a couple years ago. I found a fresh scrape on the way in, hung my camera on it. But the big change up is that little guy. I gave up the longbow for now. And uh, gonna try to get one with my compound. So I'm cheating, sorry Brad. Anyways, if something steps out tonight, it's probably gonna die. But I'm feeling really confident. It's a mist. It's been misting for about an hour now. Super cold. Um, the deer are already on their feet. Brad's already seen one. Um, some of the guys with cell cameras are getting pictures already. So just got settled in for the evening hunt. Should be exciting. Back in the truck. Uh, just pick a little spanky up. And uh, we got soaked. But I did have, I took a video of the little small four point that came by. And uh, while I was sitting there watching him go by, I heard something behind me and turned around and looked. And there was a nice, looked like probably just a big eight. And uh, I mean, he was right downwind. So I didn't even get excited. I knew he was going to catch my wind. And uh, sure enough, he did. And uh, anyways. So I got down because five minutes later it started pouring. And now we're sitting here in the truck waiting to pick up Brad. 
figure he'll be here any second. I don't know if we're going in the morning or not. Our clothes got really, really wet. It's supposed to be rainy and cold again, but we'll see. Night number two. Got potatoes done in the jet boil. Got the steaks of sizzling. Got some corn flavor on it. Corn Got the up. corn over here. Mmm. That's what I'm talking about. Maggie, how many deer did you see? <laughs> Not three. Good. I'm zero. glad you're seeing three. You was holding up a three. Fat zero. Awesome. How many did you see, Brad? One. I seen two. Let's see. Okay, guys, it's October 29th. I didn't get a video yesterday, but that's not a big deal because I didn't see anything yesterday. Anyways, we had to get in late due to the rain this morning. And uh, we're going to try and see if we can make something happen. Thirty-two degrees this morning. Last night we all got soaked. It's a little more windy today. It's supposed to around ten o'clock. They're supposed to start sleeting and snowing. I think we're gonna get down a little before that. Pack everything up. Head back home. <laughs> Why are you already wearing your saddle? <laughs> it looks just like a soiled diaper. What are we doing? What's that for? I'm gonna go to a You are? I don't know can you even sit down in there with all that stuff on? <laughs> Get in there. I gotta see how this works. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe he gets in the truck with that on. Here we go.